The militant group Hamas is holding more than 100 people captive after its assault on Israel. Another 30 are being held by a Palestinian Islamic terror group. WGN Sean Lewis has more. Tonight, the search for missing relatives intensifies in Israel. It's not Arabic and Israelis and Jews. It's really about humanity. At a press conference, parents pleading for the government to help. Their children, most of them young adults, are missing. We heard gunshot uh, around the car. We don't know if they were shot or not. Hamas militants, they say, targeted a music festival just a few miles from the Gaza border. This woman's 23-year-old daughter called her on the phone. We heard uh, the, the firing, the guns. Uh, they sh shot everywhere. My daughter was going into a car with a friend, and they were driving. They tried to drive away from that. They couldn't drive too much because it was so, a lot of cars, a lot of kids, so they ran into the bushes and she was hiding in the bushes and she was calling me and saying, Mommy, I don't know what to do. There are a lot of Arabs here and they are shooting at us. I don't know where to hide. We are 10 kids here and we don't know what to do. And I said, Romy, stay in your place. We are trying to find a way to take you out of there, but I didn't really have any answer for that. It is a story echoed by every parent here. And to the north, outside Tel Aviv, those who are missing relatives are giving DNA samples, just in case. She was in the party um, with friends. Rachel Muallam's daughter, she says, was injured in an attack and was being taken by ambulance for help when she was presumably kidnapped by Hamas. But we don't know uh, where is she now. It is the same for Moore Strakovsky, who's looking now for her 63-year-old mother. She was kidnapped uh, with her husband and two neighbors from Kibbutz Be'eri. And uh, I guess they are in uh, Hamas now, in, uh, in Gaza. Uh, that's it. It is a state of chaos, of not knowing where they are or what comes next. In the meantime, I don't know uh, more. Uh, I uh, try to keep... Uh, to keep... Uh, optimistic uh, uh, spirit and uh, wish for the best. Sean Lewis, WGN News.